Hey there, and welcome back here. Um, we just created a dynamic header just before with some various information about the plug info, the char set, the description and title. And uh, in this video, I would like to talk a little bit about how we can get this header line because we have this really come in handy WordPress header line or header bar where we can create pages or posts, we can visit the site and update the site and so. And if we take a look at this theme here, we don't have anything. So that's a shame, I think. And uh, because then you need to you need to go back to the back end uh, to get this line here. And it is actually really easy to get that. So what do we do? Uh, we go back to the code and we need to type in two lines of code here. And the first one is the VP head inside PHP tags and we just type VP head there. So this is an indication to WordPress that it should load its special header. And if we save it and update it, nothing is really gonna happen because we also need to, yeah, you can see we get this white rectangle up here, but we don't have any header. And that is because we need to close it down here in the footer and And we need to type in VP footer. And that's because the, um, the header line up there has JavaScript that needs to be included in there. And uh, now we've included both. And we get the awesome header title up there. And if we inspect it in the bottom, let's just have a look in here. Yeah, you can see it injects some JavaScript code that is necessary in order for this um, header bar to work, actually. And then it injects some other code here. So that's really it for that. That was uh, not a lot of coding here, but it gives a nice result. All right, thanks for watching. Have fun with this. Bye-bye.